How you feel? How you feel, Augie? Your third one straight. We had a really good game tonight. We had, I think, about five different people score. Defense was flying around. It was a great team win. Yeah. You ain't, ain't cross your mind that, that this one right here might, might ball up and go the other way? Just the first team to score on y'all all season. Well, you know... As an offense, we take the blame for that. We put our defense in two bad situations. We turned the ball over inside our own 30 twice, and we can't do that. We put them in a bad situation, and, you know, they really made the best of it tonight. They made a lot of great stops, and, you know, I have 100% confidence in my defense. See, so you're going to have to excuse me, Olga. On this one, this is my first interview. They sent me out here by myself, so I really – this is my first time. Not, I know you're probably used to big cubs, but I seen I – seen like I seen you shaking big a couple of times. How what was going through your head on that one? No, it was it was good. My my lineman gave me some big holes, and it was good to get get out in space and run a little bit. Just I was just having fun out there. All right, Augie, right, we gonna get on the part of here. Appreciate you, bro. Yes, sir. In the big sky, and we're underway. And the kick will go two yards deep into the end zone. And this will be John Santiago, the true freshman from St. Francis, Minnesota, up the far sidelines. And Santiago will give UND outstanding field position as he took it across the 45-yard line. And the SU, and that is his biggest carry to his young career. He lined up one play last week as wide receiver, carried it two times against NDSU, and here's Santiago, and he rips a big play inside the 20-yard line. Wants it more. Get those big guys in there, get those big bodies moving. Santiago's got the corner, and he's got the touchdown. John Santiago had clear sailing to the far corner of the end zone. The game and a 7-0 North Dakota lead off UND score on its initial offensive possession. Scott to fire, and it's picked off! Deion Harris, and Harris will look for the end zone. He's tackled at the 8, but Deion Harris... On first and 10 with four and a half to play in the opening quarter. They fake the jet sweep, they roll out Studrud, looks across the middle, and that ball is picked off. Nate Walker... Check it, Daryl Graham, 21, not 31. Daryl Graham has the pick for UC Davis. Turn on timeout, it's third and eight. Little bubble screen, it'll go to Chris Martin, and Martin finds the end zone. Chris Martin, which has been UC Davis's big play receiver. Luga, the tailback, third and goal from inside the one for UC Davis. Looking to tie the football game. Lugan, no! Will Rattel! Oh my goodness! Rattel hammers Lugan to the turf, short of the end zone. Well, I tell you what, Will Rattel right there, that's man on man, and, he, and you're not going to win many of those battles against Will Rattel. Good job by the D-line, getting on those offensive linemen, not letting them get to the inside linebackers. Will is able to come down and just meet that play. That's a big pride in what they're doing. And, and they're sick and tired of hearing about how they haven't been able to move anybody. Santiago will try to get to the pylon, and he does! Touchdown, North Dakota! The game plan coming in was stretch out UC Davis laterally, make him defend us east and west. Tank Harris in the middle, rather. Johnson at the defensive end, along with Greeley. Scott, under pressure, fires, and he's got his man for the touchdown. Chris Martin with a second touchdown reception of the day, and the Aggies answer back. Cole Reyes is not out here, and I'm not saying that's why they score, but, you know, this is where Cole's at. Cole plays that free safety position and, and probably comes down and, and meets this thing before we get in the end zone. But, you know, William James. And he has led from the start today, built a 14-0 lead. Scott under pressure, sacked for the second time today, and the defensive MVP of this game, Will Rattel, has his 12th tackle of the game and fourth tackle for loss, and Scott is hurt. Okay, the field goal. And Ben Scott has returned as the UC Davis quarterback. Down by 14 late in the game, they want six. They throw it over the middle, and he's got it, Nehemiah Winston. Exactly, and, and, and I wouldn't be surprised if they don't go back to that play, too, and try and hit that receiver in the corner, single coverage. Play action across the middle. He's got him. Touchdown, UC Davis into the hands of Alex Cannon. 
And you see Davis has pulled within one possession. Well, it pays off. Good job by Scott. Defense on their toes, and overall, just a good game today. John Santiago, career high running the football. Will Rattel, career high defending the football. Those two get stars of the game as well.